It's time to check out the latest in grilling accessories. Here with the hottest items, design expert Sarah Gunn. <laughs> the whole grilling experience, right? It's all about the toys that you have to go with it. Well, yeah, especially if you're not Randy. Like, we're just yes. regular people in our backyard cooking food. Right. So anything we can have that helps make it easier, fancier, fewer steps, I think is a win, right? It's a definite win. Yes. Especially when these they look so cute. Oh, there's so many fun things. Mm -hmm. So, okay, let's start with this right here. This is a charcoal companion non-stick <gasps> fish grilling basket. Oh So you gosh. open it up, and of course it's cute. It looks like a little fish, which yeah. is fun. I love anything kitschy like that. You just set your fish in there, close it, and there's a little piece that slides over to lock it, and it's so much easier to barbecue. It doesn't stick to your barbecue. Yes. It's easier to flip for cooking. So it's a really good one if you like to grill fish a lot. Well, especially then you get that whole fish, that whole grilled fish, exactly. which is why, how everyone loves to do it. Oh, exactly. Okay, this one's really fun. So this okay. is the J Creator Barbecue Branding Iron. All right. With changeable letters. So you can write anything you want on here. <laughs> Let's see if we can see what that can says. Can you see what it can says? Because it? it's backwards, guys. City but. line. You can brand it for your guests. You can put your last name on it if you're a real narcissist. <laughs> exactly. This is exactly. more meat. I made, I made more this. meat. Yeah, I made that. <laughs> uh, birthday parties, whatever. It's really, really fun. It comes with, I think, 55 letters. You can change cool. it. All you need to do is set it on a hot grill. Yeah. And then press it onto your meat. That's awesome. I think it's really fun. Personalized Kay. meat. Um, this is the best thing you could have ever brought here. I totally Can agree. Can we just talk about what's yes. in there? This is so much fun. So this is a s'more to love s'more maker. So you it's do not need to go maker. camping. I'm not. Are you a camper? No. Oh, me neither. No, no, no. no. So you can make them in the comfort of your backyard on yes. your barbecue with this fancy little thing right here. So it pops open like that. Oh. And you just layer in your graham cracker, your chocolate, your marshmallow, another graham. That's so good. Right? Six at a time, so just enough for me, and then um, <laughs> everyone else can have a turn with it after. That's right. They can have the next batch. Right. So uh, if you're, you know, going to be barbecuing, you need to look the part too, right? So Absolutely. there's some really fun aprons that you can pick up. Including the like one this. on you. Yeah, and I want to say actually all of those items are from Amazon. Good, okay. so easy to find, easy to get. No, e exactly. Many people have eaten my cooking and gone on to live normal lives. <laughs> <laughs> Partially true. Um, so, yeah, you can get all kinds of really fun, silly ones. Yes. I think these are a great gift for people, too, if they're really they into are. outdoor grilling. Especially if they're, you know, they're the grill masters. Uh, make yourself at home. Clean my kitchen. <laughs> <laughs> and this one's really fun, too. If you want breakfast in bed, go sleep in the kitchen, y'all. Yeah. <laughs> that is awesome. Those they're a lot are of fun. Cute. Yeah, they're a lot of fun. Okay, so, so moving into this area here. Yes. Uh, these aren't obvious to me. What are these things? Okay, I'm not going to make you guess. This okay, is for making chicken wings. So you oh. actually suspend them on here. You use okay. less cooking oil, so it's a little bit healthier. Yes. They have a more even cooking. They're not going to burn as easily. That's a little bit cool. easier to clean up as well, which I think is really important, right? Yeah, you've got the great drip tray mm -hmm. there underneath. That's awesome. Um, and I'm a huge fan of jalapeno poppers. Oh. I absolutely love them. So yes. this is a tray that you can use to make your own at home. It even comes with a little tool to help clean out your peppers. Nice. Yeah, and it just, again, it suspends them so they cook more evenly, yes. easier cleanup, easier setup. Lovely. Yeah, makes your job in the barbecue a lot easier. And this way you can just barbecue more. Like we're always saying, right. is, grilling isn't just about meat. You can go there with your veggies and all, even your desserts. So this yes. way you've got all of the options when it comes to your grill. Right. Um, this guy, which is frightening. Yeah, it's, it's, it's not a weapon, I no. promise. It's a kebab fork. So it's okay. nice and compact, and you can add several items on the same one. So it's not really taking up as much space yeah. as lining up all of the different ones, right? That's so that's a nice true. option. I feel like you could put marshmallows on the end of that, too. 100%. Right? Why not? That's what I would use it for. Yeah. And this guy here? So that's a brush. For massages? <laughs> yes. No? Right now. <laughs> um, the Brush Tech Barbecue Brush. So I don't know if you saw last year, there was all this conversation online. I saw a lot of the traditional brushes, the bristles breaking off. Yes. and being hazardous and dangerous to, when you consume them. Yes. So there's some alternatives now that are really interesting. Okay. This is one because nothing's going to break off and it just rolls right on your grill. Right. Yeah, exactly. Okay, and nice. it won't scratch. Very good. 
And then finally we've got this one yeah. here. This is the Broil King version and it's wood, obviously, mm -hmm. which is really nice because it's non-toxic, non-dangerous. And I yeah. love how it's got these ridges. So it will actually kind of conform to the shape of your grill and really, really give it a good cleaning. Ah, that is so important. Yeah. The cleaning is the worst part of the grill, right? I know. I and like you to leave do that it to someone else. I know. Well, you do. If you've, done the cook, if you've done the grilling, you're allowed to leave it to someone else. Right. Um, look at these. Yes. Shaped like golf clubs. Yes. Those so are fun. for the golf enthusiast, this is a great gift. If they're also the grill master and the golf enthusiast, even pr more perfect. Oh, yeah. Those right? are a lot of fun. Uh, you know, I, the one thing I like about entertaining outside is you can get a little bit silly and kitschy with the kitschy. things that you're, yeah, with totally. that you're using. You can have a little bit more fun with it. And I think even people have more fun with their decor outside. You I know, agree. we're more prone, I know I am, to use color. I wouldn't be using lime green in my house, but there's lime green in the backyard on, this, on the cushions and the tablecloth. Right. Because it's fun and it's summer and it's, you know, it's light. Yeah, right. It just adds to the atmosphere of the whole situation. Yes. So we've also got, I think this is really, really cool. Do you want to pick up that little... Um, this little weapon? Yeah. So that's a laser surface thermometer. Okay. Which is so cool. So you can use that for your barbecue, yeah. for a pizza oven, to a frying pan, and it measures the surface temperature right. with a laser without okay. contacting it. So you just aim it at the target, we'll yeah. see how hot you are. Press the trigger. Okay, I am, I'm hot. <laughs> Check that out. Nice. So I don't know if you can see that, uh, Julia, but there it is, 75. That's so cool. It's really cool. So you don't have to touch anything, you don't have to poke anything. Let's see if you're hot too. Okay, let's see. I bet you you are. And you don't have to clean it. Woo, 84, oh. Sarah. Oh. You're smoking. <laughs> That is so it's, cool. It's the apron. Right? Yes, that's what it Definitely is. Definitely the apron. Okay, very cool. So that's one way to do, uh, to take temperature. Right. The infrared laser thermometer. This is another. Now, yeah, if you're cooking with some meats, you really like to, you know, have something submerged inside the meat to check the yeah. temperature. So this is the Weber iGrill 2. Okay. And it's a Bluetooth connected thermometer. All right. Which is really cool. So you can have an app that you download to go with it. Yeah. And you can add up to four probes. So there's one that you're holding up there and yep. they're color coded. So oh. you can stick those into different items on your barbecue yeah. and the screen will display so you're holding the red one it'll tell you what what temperature the red item is versus the yellow right and you can pick up other ones as well to go with it so it makes you know barbecuing a lot safer yes right when you're dealing with meat you want to make sure that everything's cooked to a certain temperature and that kind of takes the guesswork away and yeah. the fact that you can check it on your phone if you're in the house preparing something else to go along with your meal you still have access to that information very good okay so that is what freaks people out about barbecuing not Agreed. knowing the temperature. Randy mentioned it earlier, the whole idea of having this Bluetooth attachment. So